if uh, T3 and Young RJ weren't sitting here, I'd start singing. Okay. There we go. Just like you. Oh, okay. Oh, you put it together. Oh, you putting it together. Who talking about that? Who talking about that? Who didn't know about that? Who didn't know about that? Who didn't know about that? Hey, Slum Village, always happy to have you guys in the house. You know, thank you for like I said, uh, rap royalty here in Detroit, thank in my you, opinion. Uh, talk about this. Um, you done, I was just talking about this. You've done so many different collaborations throughout the years. Mm -hmm. How do you decide? How do you connect? How do we connect? Um, that's a good question. You know what? We just go with what works at the time. Right. We, uh, we make the song. Jay usually comes up with the beat. Mm -hmm. And then we build on it. And then we think about who can we hear on this. Yeah. And, it, and from that, that's what we do. We reach out and see who picks up the phone. <laughs> 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 and then, uh, OK, then it's on. Let's go. That's, that's how For it sure. goes. And you hooked up with the dramatics. How did that happen? That, that comes from like the family history. My parents had a group in the 80s called RJ's Latest Arrival. Nice. And um, you know, from them touring and having a studio, they just met lots of people. Mm -hmm. Dramatics was one of those groups that used to come through. Mm -hmm. And then they, they was like uncles, you know? Oh, so yeah, yeah. We got them, had them record on the song one of these days, and then we just sat on it till the right time. So T said, man, we need to go in this vibe. That's and nice, then man. we went and pulled it out. And there we go. I love it, because you know it's a music town. Right. It, it, that's cool to hear, because I hear those kind of connects often, but it, you never know who's connected to who and how. For sure. Yeah, very cool. Uh, so uh, let's talk about, um, you guys have a connection. We're looking at some, some one of your old videos right here. OK, man. yeah. How does it make you feel when you see this with T3? Oh, I was young. <laughs> what what you know about that? Lighter, like, you know, yeah, you know, I love it, though. That's, that's, that's a start. That's how we got our big break. That was our big break. Taney was our big break. Yeah. So you know what I'm saying? It was all love. I, I can't be mad at that. Now, you guys got a collab. Is it with Puma? Yes. What do you guys do with Puma? Uh, we got a shoe coming out with Puma. Stone Village has a shoe coming up? Yeah, a yeah. collab. Uh, shout out to, uh, to Rick Life. Williams, The Stink Life. And yeah. uh, they, they showed us love, brought us in. And, and you know, it's, it's dope that we was able to do this. You oh, know what I'm saying? that's cool. For the 50 years of hip hop. Nice. You know what I'm saying? Yes. Uh, shout out to Fat Cat, too. He was a part of that, too. For so, sure. Yeah. So, yeah, we happy to do that. That's coming out in August. Of course, we got a pair for you. You the man. You, <laughs> you got to come back when, you, when, 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 you, when you get the shoe. You got to come back. OK, yeah. How do you design a shoe, man? You're like, ah, no, I don't like that. Guy. I mean, are you involved? I I wasn't involved. That was mostly Rick. He, yeah, he had was an Rick. idea for this, and then we was like, okay. Because you're artist, you know. You know what yes, I mean? Yes, yes. Yeah. And when he showed it, I was like, man, this is ridiculous. This is. It's ridiculous. Yeah, the That's shoe it. is based Good. around uh, the pivotal album, Fantastic Volume Two, and um, so they just wanted to do something to celebrate. Yeah. And it's plus the 50 years of hip hop, 50 year anniversary. So all of it is tied into this shoe, mm -hmm. and you know, it's just dope. Cause be appreciated in that manner by Man, being Matt celebrated like here that. here in the city. Music Hall this weekend, what can people expect? Music Hall, we're going to have fun at mm -hmm. the Music Hall. It's, it's going to be it's gonna be dope, man. Sure. A lot of family members coming out. Yeah. <laughs> so I expect the family to be there. You know what I'm saying? We're going to have some fun. You stopped picking up the phone for them comp tickets yet? <laughs> I got a cutoff number. It's a cutoff number. It is a cutoff number. But yeah, it's all good. So we're going to be doing that, having fun. Y'all come out. Yeah, we're sure. going to kick it. Yeah, tickets available at Ticketmaster. You want to go see Slum Village t at Music Hall this weekend. See this Sunday. Uh, is that Sunday or Saturday? Sunday. Sunday. It's Sunday. All right, June 4th, 7 p.m. And you can go to Ticketmaster to get a ticket to leave. Oh, one thing going forward for Slum Village fans, they can expect what from you guys? Uh, new album coming in August. For sure. Docu-series we're Docu -series working on. Docu-series nice. we're working on. Nice. Yes, yes. So we got a lot of stuff in the works. Slum Village. Thank you, girl. Always, you always welcome here, fellas. We appreciate y'all. And make sure you check them out at Music Hall. Like I said, Ticketmaster is where you get those tickets. They will be here for you.